Okay, so I know that I'm probably blown out uh, and then we're going in 60 frames per second, but I'm taking some photos of for my brother's website and so we have this black truck as our subject. Now, we're kind of in a weird lighting situation because it's about uh, two-ish. So the sun is way up there. You can see, you can kind of see where the sun is looking at the shadows here. It's coming like right, almost right down on the car. So we have a black truck and we have a silver car over here that's almost like a reflector in the paint of the car. Okay, so a little a little caveat, I am editing. Okay, I'm editing the video that you guys are looking at right now, right there, there it is. The cam the, the back of the screen was super blown out, so I couldn't see half the stuff I was talking about. In editing it, I realized that it's not as bad as it was, and I, I realized that you can like totally see the silver car in the, re the reflection of, of the truck. So it didn't it, it didn't look as good as it did in the back of the camera now that I'm looking at it. But you can see that the dark car adds different as a different effect to it than the lighter car. Okay, so that's 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 the caveat. That's the thing I just wanted to say before you guys continue. All right, let's continue. I say that because you come over here and you have this darker car here, and this side is just flat and uh, it's just in shadow. So typically, I would want to bring this car over here into the shade, the shade spot right here. And there's a shade spot right here. So then I could expose I could expose it properly so that the paint is properly exposed. Is that right? So you can see the details of the truck. Because right now it's just looking like a black, just cavernous. You can't see the detail. You can't see that this actually is. I don't know if you guys can see that. This actually is like a metallic paint. And that's really not showing off right now. So my brother kind of has something in, in store for this guy. He wants to take the truck, put a full wax on it, and I'm thinking maybe when he does that, that I will take it. There's a location that I want to shoot at. It's got all these trees. So maybe in fall time, take that over there, and it should look pretty cool. So I just wanted to show you guys that little example uh, real quick. Hopefully, hopefully this is usable, and it's not super blown out. Uh, so yeah. Okay, so I wanted to add that I took these photos of my car in the shade and there's a huge difference between in the shade and outside of the shade. No, in the shade and in direct sunlight. Um, so I wish I could have gotten the car in the shade, but we'll see how the photos turn out. Maybe after a little bit of editing, uh, they would have turned out okay. So, that's pretty much it for this video. I don't know when you guys are seeing this, actually. So, if this is the end of the video, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video, or... I don't know where else I was going to see you, so I'll just see you in the next video.